guys so this video is about some of the things I've been loving here in Japan and yeah I decided to call this video my summer favorites because not all of these things are from Japan but I just wanted to share with you some of the things that I've been loving this summer while I was in Japan while I'm filming this I'm still in Tokyo at my hostel in my room here but while you're watching this I'm probably back in Denmark I've only put one vlog out every week because I haven't had time to edit and I also wanted my vlogs to last long so you'll definitely see all of them but you just have to wait a little longer but now I'm going to talk about the thing that I really wanted to talk about in this video my summer favorites my first summer favorite is snacks I'm a person that just love chips or crisps or whatever you call it in your country um, and I've been loving these chips from Kalbi. These are nori flavored chips and yeah I just love them. I really like nori. So it's just like a normal chip I think and yeah then it has nori on top. Yeah, I think you can see it here. So yeah it's just chips but with nori on top which is amazing. I don't know I just love Japanese sized chips bags because you can bring them easily anywhere. You can eat it one person but if you have like Danish sizes you just can't eat one bag, one person, it's just too much. But this is perfect size, I think. So the next snack is Chocoball. It's just like chocolate inside. You can get different ones. These have like something crispy inside. And you can also get with peanuts and different kinds of things. But this one is with Ichigo or strawberry flavor. I discovered this one recently and yeah, I love everything strawberry. So I love this one. I really want to tell you about my favorite ice cream here in Japan, but I just love all of them. <laughs> like I really love the matcha ice creams. They're so good. About my next summer favorite thing, I want to talk about drinks. This year I've been trying not to drink soda and something with too much sugar in. Um, so I've been drinking a lot of tea. This one is Tea's Tea, a uh, really good tea brand. And this one is with rose and peach. I think Tea's Tea is really good because it's not too bitter like some teas can be, but it still has sugar in it and it's really delicious. And I've also been loving this green dakara ever since I came to Japan. I'm, I'm still drinking it. I'm not sure what you would call this kind of drink, but it contains minerals and you can see what's inside here. And it's really good, but I'm not really sure what you would call it. It's like vitamin drink maybe? We don't have this kind of drink in Denmark, so... I don't really know what you would call it, but it's good. Another drink that I couldn't get today was the new Fanta Peach, which is really, really good. So yeah, it's Fanta Soda, and I've been drinking it two times now. Um, I think it came out in the end of July or in the beginning of August, but it's really good, and you will see it in some of my vlogs. About other soft drinks, I really love to go to Starbucks here because it's not so expensive. And I love the caramel frappuccino, matcha frappuccino, and vanilla frappuccino. You see, I don't really like coffee that much, so if I have to drink something with coffee, I choose the caramel frappuccino. So the next summer favorite theme is food. And I must say, there are so many delicious kinds of Japanese food, as you may have seen in some of my other vlogs and videos. I think that this year, my favorite thing is gyoza. And I've been eating at this restaurant chain, and I don't remember what it's called but you can get like gyoza ramen and something rice set and it's just so good and it's cheap we've also been eating a lot at Caesarea so if you ever go to Caesarea you should try the tarako pasta sauce it's amazing and tarako is like fish eggs I think so it's like pasta and with some nori and fish eggs and it's so good since it's Japan I figured that I need to have a favorite cup noodle ramen or something so my favorite cup noodle is this sauce shakisoba it's pretty good last year my favorite food from Japan was shakisoba so yeah this one is pretty good <laughs> So the next thing I want to talk about is cosmetics. I'm not really sure if it's good for the skin, but I've been loving these crayons for the eyes. And I got them at a 100 yen shop. I've just been loving these because they are so easy to apply to the eyes and they look really pretty. Um, so I only use a little bit because I'm not really sure if it's good for the skin because they are so cheap. So this is what it looks like. And just apply it to the eye here. When I get home, I'm planning on making a video about all the cosmetics that I bought in Japan. So give this video a like if you want to see that. The next thing I want to talk about is the scent I've been using this summer. I've been loving this Iskara perfume. I got this one as my graduation gift from my mom. And I just really love it. It smells so good. Mm, smells very summery and 
yeah, it's also called turquoise summer, so yeah, it's so good. Moving on to fashion and accessories. My favorite accessories this summer is probably this watch. I bought it in a shop called Sevens in Shinjuku, Ulta. But you can also get it in Harajuku, I think. Ever since I bought this necklace, I've been loving it. I bought this one in Thank You Mart or Sankyu Mart, which is a 390 yen store. So yeah, I think it's really cool. So these are my favorite accessories. My favorite bag this summer is this purse or bag from H&M with fringes. Yeah, it's so cool. I think it's a really perfect size because if I want to go out and I don't want to bring a whole bag, this one is perfect because it can contain all of my important things. But yeah, I'm just a big H&M freak. <laughs> so my favorite skirt this summer is this one. I just love this denim fabric and I just really like the length of this one. It's not too short, not too long, but it's just perfect. And if you're at a really cold place, it's not too cold with this one on too, so it's a plus. My favorite top is this one. It's from GU and I just really like this design with the arrows. But yeah, I like the color and the style of it, so. My favorite shirt from the summer is this one. It's a shirt from GU and it wasn't that expensive, but the fabric is just so nice. I love it. <laughs> I've already thrown my favorite sandals out because, yeah, they broke in the end because I use them every day. But yeah, you will probably see them in my vlogs a lot. I have two pair of favorite sunglasses, the ones with hearts that you might have seen, and these Aussie sunglasses. But yeah, that was my favorite fashion item. Among other items, I've been loving these fake tattoos or temporary tattoos, especially these with gold and silver. They're so cool. I don't know if you can see, but I'm wearing this one right now that says Dream. And it's an infinity mark. But yeah, I think they're really cool and I got almost all of these for 200 yen, which is pretty pretty cheap. Maybe it's because summer is almost over so they're selling them cheap, but yeah, I got them really cheap. I think these kind of tattoos are pretty cool for people like me because I've always really wanted a tattoo but I have never been able to decide what tattoo I want and if I need to get a tattoo it needs to be something really special and something that I've been thinking about a lot. So yeah, this is a pretty good option for me. <laughs> and they're so sparkly. The final favorite from this year is my favorite song. And I've really been loving Lean On by the Danish artist Mu and some other artists. It's been really popular in Japan. I've heard it in so many stores. She's pretty cool because she's Danish. Um, but yeah, I'll leave a link to it right here. So that was it for my summer favorites. And if you want me to make spring favorites and autumn favorites and winter favorites, please write it in the comments below and maybe I'll make those too. But thank you so much for watching my video today. I really hope that you enjoyed watching. And if you wanna watch my adventure and my vlogs from Japan, you can find it on my playlist on my channel. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you guys very soon again. Bye!